Good morning. I'm out here at San Domingo today with some friends from BC. That would be Canada. And uh, he has a channel. Well, they all do actually. They're all on the channel. It's called Gridlessness. And I highly recommend when you're done with this video, you go check it out. But they're here today with their three daughters. It's Jeff and Rose. And they got three daughters out here. And we're learning how to metal detect. We're looking for nuggets. <laughs> looking for nuggets. Okay. And the girls all grabbed the detectors and took off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, but they're all doing really good if you watch how they're working over there. I mean, they listen really well and they're all moving nice and slow and digging targets. So I'm going to spend a day out here with them today. We're going to do a little dry washing probably. And after the dry wash, I'm going to come back out here in a day or so. And this afternoon, I'm going to take them up to a good spot, leave them there, maybe get a nice big chunk of gold and leave them a couple of detectors to play with. So they'll have a couple of gold monsters and uh, I'm going to leave the manticore with them too. Can't leave my 6,000. <laughs> That's my baby. I got to have it with me. It's like, it's like a pacifier, you know? <laughs> so anyway, if you watch how fast they're moving and what they're doing, they're on top of things. And I'll be back. We're waiting for Rick to get out here right now. And he's going to bring a dry washer. Yeah, I don't know where he is, but he'll get here eventually, I'm sure. But they're here for about a week and just got back from Mexico. Yep. And, uh, oh, you got to be brave to go down there this, this day and age. But <laughs> do, do you guys have a condo or something or just camping? Just camping, yeah. Just camping. Okay. There's a lot of them in here. All right, I'll be back in a bit. Well, Rick showed up. He's over here. And we got our friends from BC dry washing. It's the first time any of them have done anything like this. So we're having a lot of fun out here so far. Was it not gold? Look, look at all that Hold gold. On, which one? This one? Now there's some uh, yellow lead oxide that you oh, find here. sometimes here. Oh, it really gets your heart jumping. Is. That might be what Kizzy just picked up. Yeah, it's yellow. I mean, it's got green on it. Oh, well look at all this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> now that, my friends, is the result of... Look at that. Less than a quarter oh, yard of dirt. Well, that was just like 10 minutes, hey? At least it seemed like that when the girls were shoveling. <laughs> well, that's what we just get to stand here and watch them all work. Those three did all the work. Don't don't take, don't let them tell you yeah. anything else. This is like a little piece of wiry stuff. Oh man, that looks great. That's nice. amazing. Cool. Nice. Arizona Desert Gold. You know, and if you sat here and camped right here and did that for a day or two, you'd yeah. end up with quite a little nice little pile of gold. Totally. I got a dry washer you can use. Yeah. What's that? That one wasn't? Mm -hmm. hmm. Okay, so our nugget is still bigger. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> You'll get if you keep digging out here, you're gonna get one yeah. bigger if it's that small. But yeah, is that's it, just from what? a few minutes. <laughs> <laughs> huh? What's this coppery looking? Is that just a rock? Oh. Uh, that was... Okay, cool. Well, snuffer. Need a snuffer. I don't know where is. You got one? We got some snuffers. Yeah. There Are you go. Your it's your gold. Yep. All right on. Sorry, they are in your backpack? Yeah, there's snuffers up there. Okay, thanks. I'll, uh... You do it for me. I'll go grab it. Again, I'm going to mention the channel Gridlessness. Um, if you want to see some cool stuff up in BC living off the grid, I highly recommend this channel. And there awesome, you have eh? it. That is awesome. It's just mind blowing that it works without <laughs> water. You know, like if I if you didn't see it and know it, 
you'd kind of be like, I don't know if that could ever work. You know, and and we forget that. Like when we're telling people or we're doing videos, we say we're using a dry washer. And sometimes I've been doing this so long, I forget like half y'all that watch the video don't even know what it is unless you see the darn thing. And then they do it like you do. How does this work? Yeah. But it works quite well. But you got to figure you probably lost, what, 10 to 15% of what went through the dry washer in most cases. So. But I mean, like the like this is this is fine gold, and yeah. for it to be capturing all that is amazing. I mean, it's awesome, yeah. And this stuff could have been processed like multiple times before in the last this couple is, hundred years. It's been gone over several times. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's keep going, girls. <laughs> Back at it. Some big big gold in that last pad. I don't have to do, but I don't get any gold either. <laughs> Thank you to Rick for bringing the dry washer out. Well, they finally got Dad working. They moved quite a bit of dirt right here. You can see we're just taking it right off the top. And right below that is volcanic puff bedrock. You can see it's some gray right over here. And they're shoveling and cleaning off the top of that. And running through the old dry washer. Plugged up. Plugged up. Plugged up. Plugged up. A fun fun day man good day for dry washing too and couldn't ask for better here's something relatively new to me and i've seen a lot of cactus but i've seen very few of these red ones i've never seen one up here so right here if you look beautiful red flowers on that now i believe this is the difference between elkhorn and staghorn choya i don't know which is which i'm gonna have to look it up when i get home but if you look over here That has yellow flowers, kind of an orange yellow, as do the majority of them. And I believe these are elkhorn. And the smaller one of the red flowers would be a staghorn. And of course the prickly pear down there is blooming too. Just got a beautiful year this year. And look, they even got Rick working now. Great folks, man. Having a good time today. Even the creosote's still blooming. I got happy bees at home. It's going to be a good year for honey. They did a long run on this one. Last pan, then we're going to go up the road a little bit. Lots of black sand. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ooh, I see. Solid black sand at the moment. Mm-hmm. When it starts showing up early in the backwash, you got a good run. I could be wrong. Can't really pan it down too much more than that because. Wait. What's that? Want clean water in here? Um, maybe. Not too much. What? What's it doing way down there? I don't know. Time to get it yeah, all. Look at that. Not bad. There's some bigger pieces. Yeah, there's oh, going yeah. all through there. Yeah. yeah. I can see it. Some nice little chunky pieces that time. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll, nice. um, I'll snuffer it a l- few times and then dump out the snuffer here and sure. look Thank at it all at better. once. Yeah. Yeah, and that's it for dry washing, folks, until maybe another day. We're going to drive up the road and try to put on some nuggets. So I'll be back. Always good to meet new people. Had a lot of fun so far. They found some pretty nice gold dry washing. And uh, we're going to go up to a little spot I know, and I'm going to get them in a little better campsite than here where all the people camp and let them go up there. Boom, I hit the window. Let them go up there and see if they can't find a piece of gold or two with the metal detectors. I'm going to let them use a couple gold monsters and uh, 
they got a gold bug too, which we all know is a great machine. Yep, got people on the radio, sorry about that. Anyway, we're headed out to this other spot. Okie dokie, I got them planted in a real nice campsite. And uh, I'm going back home for the rest of the day. Relax. And they're going to do some nugget shooting tomorrow and hopefully they'll score some nice gold. And uh, I had a really good time today. Nice folks. Um, just a good time. I always like when you can just have a plain old good time. But anyway, my friends, for now, like, subscribe, ring the little bell. Nugget shooter out.